Tonight, community organizations are preparing for hundreds of Afghan refugees to arrive in the Nashville area. We've been reporting this. Some could be here as soon as Friday. This comes as the U.S. military withdrew from Afghanistan. News Force Cameron Taylor joins us now. So Cameron, a lot of moving pieces here. Yeah, there really are, Tracy and Marius. And these families are having to restart their entire lives. That means finding a new place to live and a job. And for some, that will happen in a city or even a country they've never ever been to before. So when refugees come, it's not, it's not really a choice. Sabina Moyadeen is the executive director of the American Muslim Advisory Council in Nashville. The organization is getting ready for roughly 300 Afghan refugees to arrive. This follows the U.S. military leaving Afghanistan. We want to be there uh, to support these refugees and, and help bring a familiar face, someone with, um, who might understand their uh, cultural needs and religious needs and uh, help create a community for them. Moya Dean says the refugees will be working with resettlement agencies like Catholic Charities in the Nashville International Center for Empowerment or NICE. The first thing that everyone needs is a place to live. Moya Dean says the agencies will help them get set up. That means finding housing and a job. They'll work with landlords willing to house refugees. Everything uh, we take for granted is is new to them and and a little explanation a little friendship uh, goes a lot of long way moya dean says each refugee will get a set amount of money from the federal government that's to help pay for expenses for the first three months like rent food and utilities it's the circumstances that forces them to leave and so we we need to have an open heart and be understanding understanding moya dean says that the refugees will have trauma and will need support and love from the community. Nashville has been a welcoming city before, and we expect it to remain that way. Now, the American Muslim Advisory Council will be doing some donation drives. They'll also create welcome packages for the refugees. And if you would like to help out, just head to the story on the News 4 app to find out more. Tracy, Marius.